What if the most massive star in our universe exploded? What kind of cosmic fireworks would we witness? And what would be the consequences for the surrounding space? To answer these questions, we need to look at a star that is unlike any other. Westerhout 49.2 Westerhout 49.2 is a star that lies in the heart of giant cloud of gas and dust called Westerhout 49, located about 36,000 light years away from us in the constellation of Aquila. This star is so massive and luminous that it defies our understanding of stellar evolution. It has a mass of about 250 times that of the Sun and a luminosity of over 4 million times that of the Sun. It is one of the hottest and brightest known stars with a surface temperature of about 35,500 degrees Celsius. Vesta Hot 49-2 belongs to a rare class of stars called slash stars. They are very young and massive stars that are still burning hydrogen in their course, but also show signs of strong wind and helium enrichment in their atmospheres. They are thought to be the progenitors of wolf-red stars, which are even more extreme stars that have lost most of their outer layers and are close to exploding as a supernova. But how would Westerhout 49-2 explode? And when? These are not easy questions to answer because we don't have any clear picture of how such massive stars evolve and die. We know that they have very short lifetimes and measured in millions or even hundreds of thousands of years compared to billions of years of less massive stars like the Sun. We also know that they lose a lot of mass through powerful stellar winds which can reduce their mass by half or even more before they explode. And we know that they produce a lot of energy through nuclear fusion which can make them unstable and prone to pulsation and eruption. One possible scenario is that Westerhout 49-2 will eventually become a wolf ride star and explode as a supernova. These are supernovae that occurs when massive stars lost most or all of their hydrogen and helium envelopes and only have heavy elements like carbon, oxygen and iron left in their cores. When the core reach a critical mass, it collapse under its own gravity and trigger a shock wave that blows up the star. The resulting explosion can can be extremely bright and energetic, releasing more than 10 to the power 44 joules of energy, equivalent to about 10% of the sun's total energy output in its entire lifetime. Another possible scenario is that Westerhout 49-2 will explode as a pair instability supernova. These are supernova that occurs when a very massive stars have cores that are so hot and dense that they produce pair of electron and positrons through gamma ray radiation. These particles reduce the pressure inside the core causing it to contract and heat up even more until it ignites runaway nuclear fusion that completely destroys the stars. The resulting explosion can even brighter and more energetic than the normal supernova, releasing more than 10 to the power 46 joules of energy equivalent to about 1000 times the sun's total energy output over its entire lifetime. Either way, if Westerhout 49 exploded, it would be a spectacular sight to behold. It would outshine all the other stars in galaxy cluster and possibly even rival the brightness of the full moon in our night sky. It would also produce a lot of radiation across the electromagnetic spectrum from the radio waves to gamma rays as well as cosmic rays and neutrinos. It would also leave behind a remnant either a neutron star or a black hole depending on how much mass remains after the explosion. The explosion would have an impact on the surrounding space. It would create a shock wave that would sweep up and heat up the interstellar gas and dust in Westerhout 49, forming a glowing nebula that would last for thousands or millions of years. It would also enrich the interstellar medium with heavy elements that were synthesized in the core of the star during the explosion. These elements could later be incorporated into new generations of stars and planets, including some that would harbor life. So what if Westerhout 49-2 exploded? It would be one of the most violent and magnificent events 
in the history of our universe. It would mark the end of one extraordinary star, but also the beginning of new possibilities of life and discovery. It would remind us that we live in a dynamic and evolving cosmos where nothing lasts forever, but where everything is connected.